the state versus state video on how to be a good spy for your state and get the edge over your opponent. First of all, collect a table of information about the enemy state using the leaderboards of the top players. For General 3 I used Plasma 5 to Plasma 3, in 2 Generation 4 I used Plasma 4 on 5, and going in 2 Generation 5 I'll be using Plasma 5 and Plasma 6 headquarters. It's important to write down all the top alliances and their best fillers and rally leaders to plan and compare to your state's strengths. Always look to play to your own strengths and exploit weaknesses the enemy has. Look at the alliances and see what spaces they have, who are their allies, could they merge? Do they form a state alliance? All intel can be collected from past opponents of the enemy state, and is helpful knowledge to get hold of. Step 2 is to identify rally leaders, this can be done by looking at the chief level, current best hero, and the hero power combined. The best hero ideally would be from the newest generation. Ignore battle power for threats as this is a false factor, it can be just they have a lot of troops, not necessarily good stats. Furthermore watch out for dead accounts and cross them off the list as a threat, this can be seen if their battle power hasn't moved all week. Or if their best hero is from a past generation of heroes. A mid generation 2 isn't going to cause problems against a generation 3 much. Another important factor is to track growth and how rapidly, keeping a list of low plasma players is good practice as by war day they could have jumped up headquarter levels. This is why I recommend recording data on Monday, Wednesday and Friday to keep your results as up to date as possible. And keep your state informed. Finally on war day, use your data to target the rally leaders. Use scouts to ghost when they rally and knock them straight off of capital or towers. Use wall destroyer if you have it and replace their leaders with your players to take them out the battle. This has been the spy list. Thanks for watching and have a great day.